Hey everyone, before we dive into the news update for the Animal Farm, I have a huge announcement. I teased this a little bit in a video yesterday, but as you guys can see here, you don't see me. So I have a new style that I'm bringing to my channel and I would love to know what you guys think of this. Be sure to tell me down in the comments below and also hit that thumbs up like button if you enjoy this style. I'm not gonna be doing this all the time. There are gonna be circumstances where I will use my old format, whether it be I'm just short on time, it could be that I'm doing an interview, I'm talking with other content creators, other projects, or I'm doing a live stream. But this is something that I wanted to add in. Hopefully it gives it a little bit more of an appeal and I would love to know what you guys think. So be sure to tell me in the comments below. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit subscribe. Also, I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. Everything I'm sharing is my own opinion. It's my own research. Highly encourage you to go do your own research. And with that being said, let's go ahead and dive on into the news. So we have some great news for the animal farm. A couple key points actually for you to take away from this. Number one, the biggest thing is that the animal farm is officially up and running. Yes, you heard me right. It is live. Forex Shark, the creator of the Animal Farm, as well as the Drip Token, he's worked on a lot of different elements for the whole Drip Network ecosystem. He went into Telegram earlier this morning and everything seemed to run very, very smooth. In fact, we are seeing the total value locked for the Animal Farm rising considerably. It is important to note that as of the time of me recording this video, the total value locked is assumed to be higher than what it actually is. Forex Shark had pointed this out. There's a little bit of uh, capturing of the data on the back end on one side. It looks like it's capturing it too high. On another side, it's capturing a little bit too low. So he's expecting this to be considerably lower. I don't know how much considerably lower than this, but as of the time of me recording the video, we're seeing this hanging out around $500 million. So that is a considerable chunk of change for sure. As far as the other elements goes, I've gone ahead and tested out a couple things myself. So speaking from firsthand experience here, I was able to buy the dog tokens. That is something that you can do directly through the website. You could also do it through PancakeSwap, but if you wanna play it safe, you could just do it directly through the Animal Farm website itself. There's a tab located up at the top. And then also, in addition to being able to buy the dog tokens, I was able to stake them inside of the dog pound. I was also able to go into the farms and off of the farms, I went ahead and I took my uh, Drip BUSD liquidity pairing and I staked that so that I could start earning dog tokens there as well. So I myself was able to participate in these different elements of the animal farm. I was able to also interact with the drip garden. The only thing that I had a hindrance on was trying to connect my wallet in the sense that I wasn't able to do wallet connect. I had to resort to doing MetaMask. So if you guys are trying to connect your wallet and you're having that issue with wallet connect, there you go. There's an alternative. You can go ahead and use the MetaMask method. And so, yeah, now that everything is up and running, I think at this point we can start looking forward to all of the other elements that adds the extra flavor, the flair. This would be things such as the Dogs of Fortune game, the Scratchies, the updated Drip UI. These are things that will roll out in the future, but the, the bare essence of this, right? The meat of this whole system is officially out live. This is something we were waiting for for about, what, eight months now? Eight, nine months or so? So a considerable amount of time. Patience is hard, but guess what? The time has passed and here we are once again. I'm hoping that there's not gonna be any issues. So far, it doesn't sound like there's any issues at all. And let's see how things continue to progress. That's what I got for you guys in this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to tell me what you guys think of this new format style in the comments down below. Uh, some videos may have more animation effects. Some might have less. I'm kind of playing with things and trying to understand how to do some of this stuff in the back end, anyways. So thank you very much to my Patreon supporters. Double shout out thank you to we love safemoon.com, Murad Shaker, 
Victor Vegas and Safe Moon Oz for being higher level patrons. Also, thank you to my YouTube members for your support. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up like button. God bless, and we'll see you in the next episode.